So look what we have going on in here. This is my dark room. Was. And um, we're stripping it down and turning this into a video editing room is what we're doing. So all these pipes and everything have to go. Yep, have to go. Here's the back of the processor, our paper processor. There's that, wa that water um, filtration and temperature regulator. There's a sink in here. So, yeah, I'm just spending the day taking things off the wall and getting this room ready for paint. I don't know what we're going to paint it, but uh, here's a film dryer that has to come down. This is going right through the wall. I'll show you the other side. Alright, so there's the other side coming through the wall. This would um, process really big pieces of paper. Twenty by twenty-eight's the biggest, and we use the heck out of this machine. I used to run it in manual mode and just stick paper in there manually. But anyway, this will make a nice room for video editing. And I'm just getting it ready to come out, you know, all of it. So that's what's going on here today. Here's one of the main desks that we use for video editing, and it looks okay from this side. Not bad. Let me show you the back. Well, this is the back side of the video editing, and as you can see, there's a rat's nest of wires. And most of them have been pulled up. They were hanging here, and I had them behind a wall that I put right here. So I hid all these wires. But I'm cleaning the floors, so I'm having to pick up the wires, you know. But uh, what a freaking mess, huh? Look at all those wires. That's crazy. That's the one thing about electronics I do not like is all the wires associated with them. So I was curious how you guys organize your wires. I used to try to zip tie them, you know, and keep them up off the floor. And uh, that never worked because I, I change hardware too often to zip tie something. I just get it zip tied up and then it's time to change out or switch things around. So, um... Maybe on a future desk, what I'll do is I'll make a channel that can hide all the wire, you know. I was just curious what you guys do. Yep. I thought I'd give a little update to our digital computer room in here. And this giant hole was caused by this machine. And so we're framing it in and we're going to drywall over it. You're probably wondering about the odd shape up here, huh? Well, that's a secret. Maybe I'll show you, maybe I won't. So I'm cutting drywall for that hole that machine is in. Winging it. I've done my share of drywall, but uh, never gotten really good at it, you know? but I can get the job done. But sometimes it needs a little more patching than your average. Yeah. So yeah, doing drywall, fun stuff. Yeah. <laughs> no more hole. Now I gotta do the inside. So we're getting black paint up on the wall. Well, we're not. But he is, Steve. So yeah, probably do black walls with a different color trim. This is the first wall. Yep. I think it looks alright. Yeah, it's cheap floor, but I think it'll look great. Kind of marbly. Yep. We'll put a rug in here. It'll be great. Come along. Floor's done. Go shiny it is. Okay. 
and welcome to the new digital editing room I think it turned out pretty good Remember that hole? Yep. Let me know what you think. Um.